What is going on guys? Welcome to Greggles TV Daily. Let's get into the tech news. Our first story is about the Galaxy Z Fold 3 under display camera. We keep getting little bits of information that have come out about this with the camera quality, if you're going to be able to see the camera, and this story kind of dives a little bit deeper into that, the quality of the camera photos, and also if you can actually see the camera or not, what you actually do see. So let's jump into it. So this first tweet is coming from Ice Universe, and as you can see, he's saying regarding the under display camera of the Galaxy Z Fold 3, it uses AI, also known as artificial intelligence algorithms to assist and the picture quality is not bad although it cannot reach the level of a normal front camera i believe that the picture quality of the fold 3 is the best among several under display camera phones to be released soon so basically what he says there is that it kind of sucks but it it's the best of the sucking and basically what it means is again is all the phones that have under display cameras that are out or have been out or coming out in the near near future samsung will have the best of them and which all right great but at the same time it's using artificial intelligence to approve the photos and all of that but at the end of the day what do we want do we want better photos or do you want to not really see the camera? I mean, I don't know. For me, I guess it would be better photos. That really, I'd rather have better photos because I actually generally do use this camera more than I do this front one on here. With that said, can you or can you not see the camera on the uh, Z Fold 3 on the larger display? Well, this tweet comes from Max Weinbeck and his tweet ends up saying that, just so everyone knows, the Z Fold 3 under display camera looks very similar to the Axon 25G. And I didn't have this phone, and this is what it looks like, though. I pulled this photo from a ZDNet review of the Axon uh, 25G, and you can see it has this like little squared out cutout, but it's kind of like pixelated look to where the camera is. And from what we've heard, you can see it, you can't see it. I've heard everything that and in between. And if it looks anything like that on the Axon 25G, I would just say, Samsung, don't do it. Wait till this is completely perfected before you have something on here where you can see like a little different color colorations, variations of the, the camera on there, of the screen, of the colors, of just weirdness. It looks awkward. Hopefully it doesn't look like that, but We've heard everything. We've heard that it is hidden when you watch videos, but then it's not in certain other areas of what you're doing. I have to say, this is, as much as I'm looking forward to the under display camera because of how cool it sounds, if it is anything like what we're hearing, I'm, I'm, I am turned off by it. Well, on a brighter note, we have a special edition of the Galaxy Z Fold 3 coming out as well. So let's talk about that. This information is coming from Ishan Argarwal, who's saying Samsung's Galaxy Z Fold 3 will have an S Pen Fold Edition for it, along with a note pack case for storing it with the phone. There will be, of course, usual silicon, leather, and aramid back cases. Galaxy Z Flip 3 will have silicon transparent cases with rings and straps as options. So let's talk about that a little bit. First of all, he says an S Pen Fold Edition, and that's kind of what we've been hearing is that when you pre-order the phone, you're going to get a case with it, and that case is a uh, S Pen Edition case where it will hold that S Pen. And I also said, well, the information that we're hearing about the pre-order doesn't say that you're getting S Pen. He's saying it will come with an S Pen, and that makes a little a lot more sense, really. If they're giving you a case that can hold an S Pen, why not also give you the S Pen? And he's basically saying that it will, so that would be the S Pen Fold Edition. And then the other part to that would be the Z Flip 3 with rings and straps as options. It sounds like it would make it easier to hold the phone, like a kind of like a, a ring built into the case and a strap possibly, so that's interesting as well. But there you guys go, that is your news for today. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, new videos every single day. My question now to you guys is, is it a turn off to have the ability to see the camera, like that little cutout, that little digitized look to the camera on the screen of the Z Fold 3, but at the same time get an S Pen, S Fold 
uh, edition of the phone, a Z, a Z Fold 3 S Pen edition of the phone, is that uh, more attractive enough to make you forget about all that? Let me know in the comments down below. We'll see you guys down the road. Peace.